white chocolate macadamia nut cookies is one of my family's favorite things to indulge in. Let me show you how to make these tasty soft cookies today on Brandy Dawn's Kitchen. Preheat your oven to 350 degrees Fahrenheit. Line your baking sheet with a silicone mat and parchment paper. There will be links below to all the items I'm using in today's cooking. In a large bowl, add the butter and using the paddle attachment, you want to cream the butter for approximately a minute. Add your white and brown sugars and cream together for four minutes. Now you can use a hand mixer or a stand mixer, and I'm using a stand mixer here. And creaming these together for a maximum of five minutes is an important step. You want the sugars mixed into a fluffy creamed butter. Scrape down the sides of the bowl so that everything is mixed in well as needed. I used unsalted butter, so if you're going to use salted butter, just remove the half a teaspoon of salt later in the recipe. If you're doubling the recipe or making a large quantity of these cookies, make sure you use unsalted butter so you can control the amount of salt in the recipe. Notice how the butter is changing from the yellow stick of butter to a fluffy, light colored cream. And the sugars are well combined here. Cream the butter no longer than five minutes as the butter can begin to break down. Scrape down the sides of the bowl so that everything is mixed well. Next we're going to add in vanilla, and I use clear, and two large eggs. Mix about 60 seconds, and then scrape down the sides. Be sure to watch the cookie thief at the end of this video. If you're interested, you can check out how to properly measure baking ingredients on the tip section on our website. Now we're going to add in our dry ingredients. Add in baking powder and salt, flour, and then baking soda. Start mixing slow, and then you can speed it up to medium. And you'll see your dough begin to form into a ball. Continue to allow the mixer to incorporate the ingredients. Scrape down the sides as needed. And add the rest of the flour. You will find the recipe link in the description below. And find more amazing recipes at brandydawnskitchen.com. This still looks great and everything looks well incorporated. Next we're going to add the white chocolate and macadamia nuts. You can use chopped or whole macadamia nuts. Just mix until incorporated. Now we are ready to put them on a cookie sheet. I use a cookie scoop so all the cookies are the exact same size and they cook equally. Using a medium cookie scoop, it's a number 40, or you can measure out two tablespoons of cookie dough and roll it into a ball. Be sure to like and subscribe right here on YouTube. Follow us on Facebook. If you like to pin, look us up on Pinterest. Thanks for watching.